hello and welcome back to another video today we are going to talk about the top 20 CapCut edits stay tuned in this video or your video editing a lot of different things in CapCut and I have covered a lot of things here as you can see so, and part of this video is gonna be very nice so stay tuned and watch this video and enjoy and subscribe in CapCut we are gonna learn about uh, first tool and that is a uh, key framing I import this one and drag it to the timeline here this is called keyframing position I can click first diamond and now you can see a little diamond button now you can zoom the video and give another one and here I zoom the video again and now if I go back to this video and uh, this would be zoomed automatically so this one was the number one feature for keyframing and you can do it for the text for the uh, other stickers and all those things you can do keyframing even for the audio cuts number two here you can see music for example see that the sound is nowhere here the volume is all the way down so what i can do click here and do the first split and then i click this area because this is no music and cut another one and go to this place and delete this extra part so wherever your video i'm talking about the video if your video has no sound somewhere you breathe like this one and you can cut those parts wherever the your sound pitch is too low so you can easily cut those sounds number three feature is importing sound you can use the audio sound here in the library here but it's not all the copyrights free you can check it out that what are the copyrights free music websites import directly here or directly i can drag and drop so double click and it would be imported here and you can drag it anywhere importing a font first you need to go to websites thefont.com and here you can download any font here and after downloading you can go to your CapCut and go to your text and add a text plain text like this one once you download that font and install it will appear here so you can easily import for I have a video you can check in the description auto caption bring it to the timeline here you can see a record button here you can do voiceover hello we are testing this video and let's see how voiceovers work uh, once you are done you can stop and you can see here the voiceover has been recorded done with the voiceover but we gonna do the auto captions here click on the video go text here and here you can see auto captions and click on this auto caption and it will create auto captions for your video auto captions are here as i can see and i can change them uh, according to my own style so let's move to the next part and that is a transition split this one here and here i'm gonna apply this transition here you can just simply drag and drop and put them here as you can see between two clips there is a transition now and you can delete it and or you can keep it like this if you play this one would be a transition and if you want to keep here another transition you can also give another transition and split uh, like this one and give another transition here move to another option and that is called blur i have another video i will put in the description you can blur the whole background or you can blur just part of background this is blue mosaic and there would be a blur option this one is motion blur drag this blur here and look your video has a blur effect and you can also bring a picture here and after bringing the picture you can put this one behind and you can also do the blur tracking in CapCut. So next one is masking option. That is very much important. Video and mask option. You can use this one like this one. You want to increase decrease masking or you want to use a circle. This masking tool is used for blur as well or just want to keep this place for example just my face I want to show in this clip. So if I play this one all right so only my face is visible other things are done green screen that's very powerful tool in CapCut and uh, for example like this is my video here there is no difference between me and her anyway uh, here in your, in your video section you go to cutout if you have a green screen there is a part of green screen you can see there 
if that has that is okay otherwise you press this icon and it will automatically uh, remove the background so i was talking about removing background with green screen or without green screen so if you wait for some seconds uh, this video would have no background it will automatically remove the background without any green screens as you can see that the background has been removed i can place this video anywhere like this right so that was quite easy and simple text behind bring a video here right text here go to text right text here export all right so now just uh, go to media import just create it here and bring it to the timeline and now bring the original video as well bring it home this video i go to remove background here basic cutouts auto cutout it will remove the background so that the backside video will appear and it would have text look text behind as you can see here that video is here so text is now behind let's move to another one and that is picture in picture so you take any picture bring it to the cap cut very easy you grab another picture here to this place and this is picture in picture you can place it here place it here place it here anywhere and you can also place a video like that uh, for example this is the video and this another video is above another video so that is picture in picture and video in video all right so let's move to another part and that is called blending option you can do blending for pictures and your videos as well so for example this is picture in picture here i select and you can simply go to this one here capacity in decrease increase and it would be blended like this one and this is video i increase the blending option here decrease and it will be like that blending is quite easy all right so next one ai text to voice videos i can bring it all this way to the screen after adding this text you go to text to speech and choose any voice you like but you can choose jesse joe chill and it can also sing for you if you want to sing uh, there are a lot of options here you can choose almost done with these features and i hope you enjoyed this feature if you didn't subscribe do it right now and let's move to the last one and that is exporting video in CapCut pc and setting the frame rate so for example this is a video we are done with this one and now you just simply go to export section here and in this section you will see resolution i always export my videos in 4k video quality bitrate is this one and mp4 and you can also change mp4 or mov files and i just leave mp4 all the time and i don't do it for 24 because that's for slow videos and 30 frame per second 4k and here you can choose the destination simply hit export button you don't know how to remove the watermark i have another separate video uh, to remove the watermark hope you like the video if you like thumbs up subscribe guys and i'll see you in another video take care bye bye